Hi, we're here today with Bob Fagan, Principal Energy Analyst from DTE Energy. Bob, tell us a little bit about what's going on here today. Well, what you see going up behind us is a DTE Energy sponsored First Habitat for Humanity LEED certified house to be built in Northern Michigan. LEED is for Leadership and Energy and Environmental Design. That means this house is being taken into consideration on every step of the design, every step of the process, energy savings and improvement to the environmental impact. Bob, you've been involved in this project since the beginning with DTE Energy. You served on the design team for this. How does it feel today to be here and watch the walls go up? Well, it's great to actually see it coming out of the ground. When you look at a bunch of pieces of paper on a table and, and talk possibilities and maybes, uh, that's that, that's an important piece of it. But certainly seeing it coming out of the ground, seeing things starting to take shape, that's, that's a lot more exciting. Bob, this is new construction and uh, energy efficient. But uh, for those of us who have homes that are already built, what are some of the things that we can do to save energy on our utility bills? Well, certainly it's the, it's the easiest and most economical to build the house right in the first place, uh, taking into consideration things that really uh, should only be done while you're building the house, uh, mainly because they're very expensive to try to retrofit. But certainly in any house, uh, depending on the age of the house and what's been done to the house in the past, there's probably a lot of simple things uh, like just caulking, weather stripping, sealing, uh, stopping the air leaks, uh, those are usually the places to start. Temperature control, adjusting the thermostat, turning down the temperature in the winter, turning it up in the summer, those are all simple and easy things. Then you get into the more expensive things like furnace replacement, uh, insulation uh, enhancements, uh, uh, you know, just uh, uh, really it depends on the age of the house and what's been done because, uh, you know, years ago we did not build our houses with energy efficiency in mind. So typically the older the house, the more opportunities there are. Bob, how can I learn more about this? Go to our website, yourenergysavings.com, and take a look under the energy tips, and you'll see things that uh, can apply to pretty much any house. You can also do an online energy analysis where you can do an assessment of your own house and get some tips that way, too. That's called My Energy Analysis. Bob, that's great advice. Thank you so much, and we're going to uh, get ready for the uh, wall raising. Thank you. Looking forward to it.